This is a leaf cutter bee. She's a solitary bee and you can see what she's doing is finishing off her nest in the bee hotel. Um, there are about seven different species of leaf cutter in the United Kingdom and she's one of the larger. Just sort of come back in so you can see what she's doing. And what she's doing here is she's blocking off the entrance to the nest with lots of chopped up pieces of leaves that she's probably got from either a rose bush um, or sometimes from evening primrose or rose bay willow because that's the sort of leaf that she likes and to get to this stage and you can see there's loads of them in here and some of them are actually there's a smaller species um, that's been coming back and forwards all day and also there are a couple of mason bees that have filled up these nest tubes and what she will have done is she will have gone to the back, provisioned the tube with a little bit of pollen and nectar and then she lays an egg and blocks that little cell off with leaf and then she does the same, some pollen, tiny bit of nectar, lays an egg and some leaf and she does that all the way to the front until she's finished and she has about 30 or 40 eggs in her. So I'm going here. That's better. And she is one of some 250 different types of solitary bee that we've got in the UK. So we've got about 267 bee species in the UK altogether. And one of them is a honeybee, uh, about 25 different bumblebees, and the rest are all solitary bees. Um, and solitary bees, so this is just one single female, she's got no worker. Um, she's not a species that communicates or cooperates with other bees. She's just on her own, just solitary. And she spends ages doing this bit. She only spends about 30 seconds chopping up the leaf from the plant. That's about as close as I can go without uh, it going out of focus. And some of the others, you see the other tubes here, they're full of... So the leaf cutter uses leaves, but mason bees will use mostly mud, but there's also a couple of these that look as if they've been filled up with resin. Um, oh, there's another one coming. <laughs> so she's just come back with pollen, and the, these bees collect their pollen underneath the abdomens. You, you could maybe just see with the one that came in there. Um, so bumblebees and honeybees collect their pollen on their rear legs um, in pollen baskets that are called corbicula. Oh, there's another tiny one that's just come in here. So this is one of the smaller ones in the hole there, but they much prefer the bamboos. They've chosen the bamboos first and then they're moving on to the holes. I can't really see and I'm standing on a chair and leaning forward so it's not going to work. Anyway, so those are leaf cutters and they are in the Bee Hotel on the side of the log cabin at Bumblebee Farm. So hopefully I'll come back later and do a bit more.